Okay, this season is all about Le Flick. Um, we're recreating a look from front cover called Misbehaving. Okay, so again, I've applied a foundation over Beth's eyes and we're ready to start. We need to apply the oyster base all over the lids. Try and press the colour on just to stop the shadow from flicking. We're going to take a blending brush and just blend the shadow up into the socket line. And with the same blending brush, we just want to dust a touch of the highlighter, just dust it over the brow bones. And now we're going for lift flick. Apply the eyeliner just above the lashes, starting from the inner corner of the eye, and just draw a line across. Okay, if the thoughts of creating the line straight away is a bit too daunting, you can always just dot the eyeliner across the eyes. Open your eyes, have a look, make sure the dots are all looking pretty straight and then you can just join the dots up. Once you get to the outer corner of the eye, open your eyes, look into a mirror, and if you just open your eyes for me, and then you want to make sure your flick is working upwards. Once you're happy with the line, just keep your eyes closed for maybe a minute or so, just to make sure the eyeliner is dried. It's important that you look straight forward into a mirror to do this. If you're looking down or if you've got your eye closed, you can't always guarantee where the flicks, once you open your eyes, you can't guarantee sort of the angle of the flick. So it's a really good idea to just look straight forward into a mirror. Little tip, if you do have a hand that's not too steady, just rest your elbow onto a table and look down into a mirror. You'll find that it's a lot easier to apply the line. Okay, we're going to apply the eyelashes, but before we apply the eyelashes, I like to curl the lashes. Um, just so that they blend in really nicely with the false lashes. Again, just gently squeeze the curlers at the base of the eyelashes and just work your way upwards just to create a natural curve. So now we're going to apply the lashes. Firstly, before we start, just lay them over your own lashes just to check the length. If you need to take anything off the lashes, just snip uh, from the outer corner. Just run the base of the eyelashes through the glue. Just gently place the lashes just above your own natural lashes. Once you've applied them, just quickly look up, just check in the mirror that they're in the right place and then close your eyes again. Just hold them down for maybe 30 seconds to a minute, wait until the glue's dried. It's a good idea to look into the mirror as well once you've placed the lashes onto your eyes, just to make sure no glue's gone onto your lower lid. Whilst we're waiting for the glue to dry, we're going to line the inner rim of the eye with a black coal liner. You want to take the liner right into the inner corner of the, right, the eye and then just bring it slightly up to the inner corner of your upper eye. Okay, once we've lined the inner corner of the eye, we're going to dot the coal liner in between the lashes on the lower lash line. And then we're going to use the smudger on the end of the pencil and we're just going to smudge this line to soften. Occasionally you'll still get a little bit of glue left over, um, so we just want to use the lash liner again and just go over that and blend in the line with the false lashes. Then all we need to do is, using the mascara, again, we're just gonna blend best natural lashes in with the false lashes. Now, just before we do the bottom lashes, we're gonna coat those with mascara. What we're gonna do is, again, we've left the under eye area clear, just in case any shadow falls. So we're just gonna apply a touch of foundation and a little touch of powder. Okay, so the final touch is a tiny touch of mascara just on the lower lashes. So there you are, front covers misbehaving. Sun, I live,